happy sunday vlog i hope that y'all have been enjoying the vlogs this one is not nearly as long as last week's it took forever for it to load we are trying to do a little sunday look at here a little sunday at six today the kids say that they're going to take over next week's vlog so we'll see how that goes yeah. but y'all enjoy this episode got some to say i'm so tired I got we're both exhausted you're about to see why you're my September. So me, baby, you're my dream. Hello. Hola, la Mexico. Good. This will probably be a part of the new vlog since I haven't, still haven't posted. <laughs> forgive me, forgive me, but we are at Taco and Gallas. Hello. <laughs> Early lunch. I have to take my mom somewhere here in Memphis, and I don't let her drive here alone, so. We just snagging us a little early lunch. I'm not early, I mean like 20 minutes, it's almost 11. We haven't had breakfast. My coffee was today, so I haven't had anything on my stomach. It's the real thing. We're working. Yeah, we're going to have us a little lunch date. It's not that for us. I know there's a couple people. We came to our Airbnb because I have got to attend our Founders Day program for my sorority today. And I gotta get dressed real quick. Yeah, it smells good in here. They did good. Everyone so far so good. Fingers crossed. I'm just gonna pop this dress. Oops. Are you gonna show everybody you popping your dress off? No, I'm just gonna. Baby, no, these people are not drinking beer. These are family people, honey. Shit, I'm a family. What are you talking about? You can't drink any beer right now, anyway. I know, but I'm a family man, though. We're talking about these family folk, girl. That are coming in here. Yeah, they're 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 coming in here. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm going to come out here. I'm going to hide them. Uh, I'm going to put this over here. Put it in the back. I don't know where the cash is. No. Hey, everyone. I ain't running, right? Somebody left this damn contact in here. I'm tired, as always. It's all for me. Yeah, yeah. It's all. Oh, I don't know. Good up there first scene. <laughs> what first scene? These pearls I bought you? Yes. When did I get you these pearls? When I crossed. What about the pearls that I got you for for the wig? They're in my purse. I'm going to put them on. Diamonds and pearls. I'm from there. I ain't too far back. Really nice. We heard you in your podcast. Oh man, you need to go and set that up. Set that up front. Say less. Like, like what, what, what we on? I mean, you already know who you want to be with. You know that. Right. You know it off top, don't you? Oh, you got a lot. Don't you keep it up front and and straight? That's what it is. Yeah. Like, you got to sit here and lie. I mean, what you gonna do? I mean, I'm offering this. You want it? Yes. No. No. Okay then. College. College. Did, but you know, I'm a married man. Right, right, right. <laughs> out the game. I'm just, out the game. Out the game. He was on a podcast, y'all. Can't get him to talk on here, but on a whole podcast. But you know, I can't be vulgar on this one. But you I'm, weren't vulgar on that. I was bad vulgar. No, you weren't. All he was talking about, I'm a married man. I'm a married man. Damn, I gotta let him know. I gotta let you know, I gotta let him know I'm a married man, baby. Because I'm telling you something, they're gonna be knocking on them DMs. So I'm not gonna be what you gonna do. <laughs> Why is that so funny to us? Why is that so funny for me? <laughs> they don't want you, Bookie. You a good man. You a good man to have. Girl, come on, I gotta do this time. Are you sleeping here? Nope. You're gonna sleep in here. Let's go, girl. 
like I need to be uploading our vlog for today is what I need to be doing. I just ate for the first time today. We are here in Tupelo. I had my Founders Day program. We are gonna head back to, well, we actually gotta go to the store because I'm selling a piece of furniture, but after that, we're gonna head on back to home. So hopefully I can get this uploaded between there and now. Jojo told me he just had something really quick to do. He had the cigar bar. We are gonna see how long it takes him to be real quick at the cigar bar. He said that he started a cigar club here in Tupelo. So look at him, look at him, look. You got your, you got your hoodie, honey. Your cigar club. what that say? Who is that, child? The man. Who is that? <laughs> hey, with the smoke, baby. Cigar club, 7 2023, baby. Get with us, the smoke. This is Nailton on a Sunday. Good morning! Two of us dropping Buki off today. Her phone's still going. You can hear it. You can hear it in the background. It's like, tell me that you have kids without telling me you have kids. Let the vlog know how you doing today, girl. Yeah. <clears throat> My mama prayed over me yesterday for 45 minutes. <laughs> we hear you, Greg Grain. Behind every good man stands a good woman. I don't care what you say, you wouldn't be the man you is if it weren't for booze. Come on, now. I, I, I'm just telling you, JJ. You wouldn't be that. What you bring home, she y'all talk about it. And like she said, I give him a gentle push in his back. Hmm. Man. You, a man, no. I, I, I still be the man. You don't think so? No, JJ, you want, I'm, I'm just telling you. See, Bug Man ain't in cap. Her man ain't captured. <laughs> I'm telling y'all. That took all the energy out of me. <laughs> she prayed for 45 minutes. And then told me I wouldn't be the man that I am if it wasn't for my wife. She ain't lying to him. Girl, bye. You know your mama said it, honey. When your mama say it, it's true. You know it's true. She pre well, she did preach for about 45 minutes. And then she went She went on to a, a a long rant, okay? It was a really long rant where she was, she had a cadence. <laughs> where we at? Look where we at, y'all. Me and Target. The men's Target. He said, will you go somewhere with me real quick? <laughs> I said, where are you trying to go, Lowe's? He was like, yeah, it's just like Target. That's where JJ loves Lowe's. But I love the smell of this place. $93? Oh my God. What? I told you we should do the Target bookshelves, but no, you want to make custom shelves, girl. $93. You still want to build this closet out? Tell the people what we're doing in Lowe's. Man, boy got me out here low. She want to be all these, uh, what you call them? Them no, TikTok. No, 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 be honest. Tell the people the real truth. Bug trying to buy these TikTok uh, Target, Target shells. They thin. They thin as a chip. You know what I'm saying? Potato chip. So I said, Bug, you can just make it and make it a little bit more durable. I said I was going to do it for her. You know what that return going to be? Girl. I'll pay the toll, baby. Build we'll these shelves, but you don't get you don't get a payout in advance. You gotta get a little deposit. Now. No, you don't get a deposit. You don't get a deposit. You don't get, a deposit. You don't get, a deposit, you don't get any funds until you I see that. Until man. there is no look, you got proof of funds. You yes, got proof of funds. I got plenty of proof of funds. You got man. plenty of proof. Of funds. <laughs> you got pre-approved. <laughs> yeah, baby. You got pre-approved letter. Yeah, baby. Uh -oh. This is the letter right here. Uh -oh. Oh, he said, get uh -oh. out. Uh -oh. He said, get out of here. One day you'll have a Dewalt uh, sponsorship. <laughs> One day. Lord knows you love this brand. What you doing now? I don't know, man. You know, you're 
BK got me over here doing something. Old wire. Hello, nappy hand. <laughs> Trying to get you a little nappy? Nope. Trying to get you a little nappy? She nappy here, honey. She nappy here. Remember that song we used to play with Timber? I used to play when it was time for him to go to bed. Mm. Go to. <laughs> Sing it with me. Go, go to sleep. sleep. <laughs> go to go sleep, sleepy baby. <laughs> Tell everybody good night. Bye. Okay, okay, okay. Woo! When you start out 20 minutes behind, baby, 20 minutes behind the whole day. All day. I should have already been with our tooth fairy. You know, I told you I stand a rainy day. Well, last night it was a storm. Okay? A storm was here. And it just was a the perfect lullaby. So I overslept. Timber came downstairs and came in my room at 7.20 and was like, you were supposed to come in my room. You were supposed to wake me up. And I was like, I'm OMG, I'm so sorry. And, and, and mind you, my son has the most accurate internal alarm clock I have ever seen in my life, okay? We call him Mr. 530 because one thing about Timber J is he gonna get up at 530 every day, okay? Faithfully, hops up out the bed and turns his swag on, soldier boy style. Period. I mean, you you hear him, boom, first thing, 5.30. Amount of time you overslept, it's that way all day. Like, why did it end this way? Okay. Anyway, catch me at the tooth fairy. Okay. I am here with Sweet Tooth in the office. I feel like a professional, honey. We are here at our event space, getting ready to set up a donation day. We have people that have bought off of our Amazon list for um, children starting a nonprofit. That's what I was talking about last time, waiting to tell y'all something on when it was a little closer to becoming. Oh, does it have a gift note? Oh, Crystal, Crystal Morton, that is awesome. I have to tell her thank you. We um, started a nonprofit organization called Simple Snacks. You know, all of the simple brand is mine. So we have simple events, simplicity, and simple snacks. He is always keeping it realtor. And so anything we have together is always keep it simple. So <laughs> the simple brand is mine. But we have started a nonprofit here in Mississippi. Um, it is official <laughs> nonprofit. We did all of the paperwork, went through all the appropriate channels. And we are here in Nettleton, Mississippi, where my store is and where my husband is from. And we are donating um, snacks to children to help provide um, meals for them through the weekend. Because unfortunately, some children here in the Lee County area do not have food um, over the weekends. And they only eat while they're at school or either they eat just enough at home and they don't have enough for snack at school. So this is just to bridge the gap. Um, I know I've shared before my mom was a single parent and we didn't go without and I'm grateful for that because she did all she could but I do want to always give back to children who are less fortunate and when we can. So we are going to um, put our Amazon wish list on here. You can donate financially. All things all things donated go to the nonprofit. Bert love the kids. <laughs> we do love the kids. So we're getting ready to back up and get some snacks going and y'all stay tuned. Out, in and out, 
Now tell the people what you were talking about the other day. Behind every good man stands a good woman. Because a man can be successful, but his mate can help him be that success that he wanted to be all his life. And remember that mate can hold him back. From the day I met her, she was a very strong young lady. And she also hey, said, She's a great mother, Aww. a great husband. Oh, when my grand, she's a great cute. And even if I call, you okay, grand grand? You okay? But JJ's wife. This is not a give you, mom. Remember, God didn't take bone out of back. He took bone out of side. So beside every good man stands a good man. <laughs> but God. I'm just trying to figure out how to do it. J.J. Burke. Yeah. My name is J.J. Burke. Real name is Jameson Burke. I want you guys to know that I was the first member of the Boys and Girls Club of Northside, Mississippi. You know what Northside is, right? Yeah. I was the first member of Northside. My grandmother lived on the hill, 526 Linden Hill. All right. Okay. I was the first member of that. Not only that, y'all know Dance Before the Stars that they have? For, for, um, no, for the Boys and Girls Club. For the Boys and Girls Club. Yeah. Not only was I the first member, but I was the first member that attended. Was a, I was a participant in the Boys and Girls Club Dancing for the Star. So I knew when I seen you guys walk in and y'all sat down and y'all said the pledge, I recall myself being in that same place. And I would recite the Boys and Girls Club pledge along with you guys. So not only coming back speaking to you guys on this matter, I, it's very special to me because I remember myself <laughs> being in this same place that you guys are in. I didn't graduate from Tupelo. I am from Nettleton, Mississippi. Do y'all know what Nettleton, Mississippi is? Huh? Do y'all know what Sandy Black Nettleton is? <laughs> <laughs> y'all know what Sandy Black is? There's a whole lot of people know about Sandy Black Nettleton. So they didn't give me a fair chance when I first started off because he's new, he's black, and you know, sometimes they're going to put a little stereotype on you as being a black person in a professional uh, field. So I didn't let this stop. I had my wife keep pushing me, telling me that maybe you can get it. My mama, she gonna pray for me. She always gonna tell me, JJ, whatever you do, you gonna be the greatest. You gonna succeed, I don't care whatever you do. So she always pushed me and that always said in the back of my mind about what my mom always told me. So I started doing that. So my first year in real estate, I was the rookie of the year. Uh, I was the best dressed realtor, but my wife, she take, uh, she take credit for that. <laughs> so, and I was number one in my office. A friend and brother and a friend and wife, uh, that's going to push me in the right direction. And I always try to be right towards the next person. So I think that's the reason why I'm very successful, because I always put God first. Thank y'all. Get ready, everyone. Mommy. Next week, me and my hey, sister mom. are going to do the vlog. We're going to take over. As you can see, our parents are okay with it. Mm. Thank y'all so much for watching, tuning in this week. Uh, we had a busy week this week. And remember, if we are in the market for your next home, always keep it real to them. Hey.